Okay guys, let's begin. First, we have high squats. So dumbbells are gonna sit just above your shoulders. You can rest these on your shoulders, it's completely up to you. The reason I've put the dumbbells up high is to make it a little bit higher than holding them down by your sides. Your center of gravity is pulled a little bit more forward, so you're using your core a lot more. I'm trying to get as low as I can, I'm trying to aim for below parallel with the thighs, and also nice and soft at the top with the knees, draw the hips in. You can see here I'm just switching my hand grip. I'm going to show you a variation with the palms facing you. So yeah, 20 reps, take a rest, and we'll do this three times in total. Okay, exercise number two. We are on to close um, positioned squats, also known as suitcase squats. Um, this will target your thighs that little bit more. It's really important to try and push your bum out and try and keep your chest up with this one. So maybe fix your gaze on a certain point in front. Try and drop as low as we can. I will do variations with this, so I'll maybe go full range with the hips in at the top and legs straight or you can bend the knees and simply not straighten the legs so much just to get an increased burn across um, the thighs. You can also go into pulses of course as well at the bottom if you want to increase the intensity. So it's 20 reps, three sets.
Okay, next we're on to one of my favorites, lunges. Okay, so it's going to be 20 on one leg, 20 on the other. So it will actually be 40 reps times three sets. Trying to keep that knee down towards the floor. I was maybe not as low just because I'm on um, paving and I don't want to skiv my knee. But yeah, trying to slightly lean back, knee nice and top, at the, um, nice and soft when you straighten the front leg and keeping your hips facing forward. Three sets, 20 each side. Okay, next we're on to curtsy lunges. Curtsy lunges can be performed slightly different um, depending on your ability. Um, I'm gonna show you a really close stance where I bring the, the leg, the rear leg right round and I'm trying to drop the back knee to the floor whilst keeping my hips facing forward. Okay, so this will be hitting your quads, obviously, and your glutes um, and your hip abductors. So this will burn. The reason why I, um, doing lunge and not stepping into center each time is just to increase the intensity and yeah again this is going to be 20 each side Oh, 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 oh,
Okay, so now we're into Romanian deadlifts. You can see I am just stretching the backs of my legs. Um, you maybe want to do this, especially if you're feeling a little bit tight. Stretch the back. So Romanian deadlifts, you're gonna slide the dumbbells down your legs, keeping them quite close to the body. But what is important here is that you really um, try and feel the stretch in the back of the legs, okay, the hamstrings. Feet are shoulder width apart, toes ever so slightly out. Try and keep your shoulder blades together the whole time. Only come down to your ability. So try not to reach for the floor, okay? Because if you just reach for the floor, your shoulder blades will definitely separate. Take a few reps to get warmed up and then hinge from the hips. You're trying to keep your shoulder blades nice and together throughout. And again, this is one that you can go into half reps where you're not extending the hips at the top. You can do pulses at the bottom. So you'll see me maybe interchange here um, into different versions of this just to increase the intensity and the burn. But no matter what you're doing, always try and stand tall at the end of the 20 reps. Okay, last exercise guys, this is going to be a sumo squat. So I have been doing these a lot recently and I just find them so handy. You don't need a bar. Um, a bar is obviously great, but 
just to be able to lift the dumbbell and get straight into this sumo squats I do have the two dumbbells here trying to make that a little bit heavier and again I'm not bringing the hips right in at the top just to increase the burn so um, if you're new to this definitely stand up in between each rep and just take it easy here your feet are definitely wider toes about 45 degrees out and you're really trying to push the bum back to feel a stretch across the glutes and um, hamstrings but you will feel this in your inner thigh as well hip flexors um, try and keep your chest up the same sort of position of your back for the Romanian so where you're trying to keep your shoulder blades together chest up with this one slightly lean forward that little bit more to deepen the stretch and again yep yeah, I'll be showing you um, full range pulses etc so you can change this up as and how you feel I'm doing one rep as one one set sorry with uh, a single 10 kg just to really make me um, loosen up a little bit more and get a little bit deeper because I am feeling pretty tight and yeah that will be your workout so yeah nearly there guys keep going and this will be a great 20 minutes or so that you've worked out your legs if you want to do this again go for it and until next time I'll see you in the next video bye